Hey guys, it's me Harris, and I'm about to show you one of my favorite pastimes, and that is to play the game of Fortnite. So, what is Fortnite? Fortnite is a battle royale game in which 100 players take part in, and basically just try to survive and be the last man standing. As a student, athlete, and a gamer at this point, I just really enjoy playing Fortnite because it's fun. And that is why I'm showing this video to you because Fortnite is one of my favorite games to play and I enjoy this hobby so. Today, I've had the privilege to get some answers from two of my closest friends who also have experience on playing battle royale games like Fortnite. So let's hear what they have to say. Hi, my name is Jet Francisco and I am an avid gamer of Battle Royale games. Now for the first question, as an experienced player of Battle Royale games, what can you say are your weaknesses and strengths? For me, when I play Battle Royale games, I really go for the um, last survivor tactic in which I try to hide out when there are battles nearby. So I um, just wait it out and let them kill each other. But um, uh, I'd say that's one of my biggest weakness and biggest strength because um, it takes it really takes a lot of patience and um, patience really is key especially when you play battle royale games and um, when there's a last man standing you need to be sure that uh, that you're going to be the one who wins out in that waiting game but at the same time it has its caveat wherein you're stuck with the um, with the strongest player uh, so that's also that's really why it's a weakness kumbaga. now what are your tips for new and incoming players that want to play fortnite or battle royale games um, one advice is um, don't joke but um, what I, I can say is that um, yeah you, a practice really makes perfect even though um, you you lose from time to time it's really not a big um, indicator of your skill it's uh, it's a learning experience per se because um, when you want to play battle royale games there are many things co to consider your time your effort and of course your um, your garnered skills kumbaga. and what I can say if you if you're new if you want to get into battle royale games um, it's really going to be a hard grind but at the same time you need to to be patient with yourself and of course if you want to play with randos which is most of the time going to be if you're um, going for a four-man team then you need to have patience with others and um, you need to bite your time to um, make your shots count and as such um, try to at least um, you know uh, play have fun that's all i can really say because in the end of the day even if you're good at the game if you're not having fun that, what's the point and yo i'm harris's friend jay and um i'm what you'd call a seasoned battle royale player uh, I mean, let's say top of the head, I played Apex, I played Fortnite, I played um, uh, I played Naraka Blade Point, I played Vampire Masquerade, I played PUBG, a lot on the phone, I played Ross, Cod M, uh, also PUBG on the phone. Um, just a bunch of games, so I think I'm pretty. Um, qualified to talk about battle royale games so firstly what do i think are my strengths in battle royale games in battle royale games i'm a looter so that's one of my strengths i play into like i'm i never lack uh, in supplies i never lack in ammo so mid fight i don't always say whoa i ran out of bullets i can't kill that guy no i have enough supplies all the time because i loot all the time and uh i've sort of like i've mastered mechanics like in the most games i've played i've always tried to master the mechanics in the play so that i can um so that i can incorporate it into my play style so that like um uh, when i go into the game i'm not confused like oh this person does that or this the game has this mechanic no i always like to do that oh and third in games that do have character selection i pick characters i know how to play or i've mastered almost every character that i like the play style of that's one of my strengths so that's three strengths um let's see my weaknesses i'm really bad at strategizing i let my friend who's 
actually um i let my friend who i taught how to play <laughs> do the strategizing because um they're a whole lot smarter than me at strategizing i'm a very just go in there kind of person when i play uh what else um oh uh because i'm too busy looting <laughs> i get distracted sometimes and that becomes uh, a downfall of mine oh and i have a very passive aggressive play style just like uh, my friend is like, why didn't you help me? Or why did you go first? See, that's always, it shifts between that and that. No. So my passive aggressive play style um, is not suitable for team play. So those are my strengths and my weaknesses. Now, moving on, the tips and tricks I can give you are what I have applied in my time playing Battle Royale games. So I'd say um, three in game, three out of the game. So the first three in game is keep stacked. You know, like I said, I'm a looter, so I, I think that's very important to me to have enough supply so that'll last you till the end of the game. So that in the middle of a fight, you don't lack health. In the middle of a fight, you don't lack bullets. Um, yeah, it's important to stay supplied. Uh, two, hmm. Uh, strategize. Strategize is so important. Like, don't go into there willingly. Pick your fights. Pick your enemies. You know, don't like if you think you can't take them, don't force it. But if you think you can, go ahead. Pick your fights. Oh, and who camping? People hate camping. People talk bad about it. But camping is a great strategy. Also, actually, um, it's like. In a real war, camping works. Just have to find a place that you'll survive for the rest of the game. Um, like, say, for example, in Fortnite, there's a circle. Sometimes, well, maybe all the time, because, like, you can break houses. So there's not a lot of, like, sometimes uh, you don't have a place to hide. So just, you know, bush, never safe from bushes. So just remember, I think they've removed the building quality back so i'm a little confused now because i have not played in a bit but uh i used to play so i'm a little bit confused now but um back then when you were able to build there was not a lot of like building was your way to survive because sometimes the buildings would be broken i don't know how to do that now but so that's my top three tricks um stay stacked uh strategize and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, for outside of the game, it's easier to say this. Uh, practice your aim. If there's character selection, mm, pick a character that you really like and try to master their kit. And um, have fun. Have fun. Don't forget to have fun. Because people get so stressed out. Like, let me segue for a bit. Uh, Valorant. People play Valorant and Apex and they get so stressed in game that they forget to have fun. Like, it's a fun game. You're supposed to enjoy the game you're playing, but then you get so stressed out and it's like, you don't enjoy the game anymore. So, enjoy the game. Don't focus on, oh, I'm doing bad today. No, you, you'll get better. It takes time to get better at a game. You'll get better. So, you'll start liking playing the game more often. It'll be so much fun. So, don't forget to have fun. That is all the tips I have for you guys and as an experienced player of the game of Fortnite um, I can say that my weaknesses are definitely rushing things uh, instead of playing safe uh, I tend to just try to get as much kills as possible so I would just go fight a squad on my own and of course that most of the times that wouldn't go well and I just end up dying so I think lacking patience is definitely my weaknesses and as for my strength I think I have definitely a better game sense than most I can tell the rotation of the enemies or where they are for example and I also have pretty good aim and all of this combined also like helps me with my overall performance when I'm playing. So yeah, I think those are my weaknesses and strengths. So for my tips for new and incoming players, I think it would be that is to just have fun when you're playing the game. When you're having fun, 
you're definitely going to improve and as you improve you're going to have more fun and as you play the game more and more you're gonna meet people from different parts of the world which is gonna be really fun you're going to be able to interact with them talk to them about the game and I think that's uh, really fun and, and so yeah I think the most important thing when you're playing games right is to just have fun with it, have fun with it because that really is the point of the game is just to have fun so just make sure you don't uh, play the game to be stressed out because games are supposed to be entertaining right so yeah just have fun and meet other people and have a great time I recommend Fortnite for every kind of gamer I think it's uh, for me personally I find it really fun I like the competitive uh, aspect of it and I like the um, the aesthetics of Fortnite and stuff there's a lot of skins that you can get skins from different uh, TV shows Marvels etc so I think Fortnite is a game that if you just spend enough time with you can really have fun and some people just dislike the competitive aspects of games uh, which is which is the case for most uh, shooters shooter games but yeah I think there's you don't uh, lose anything when you try it out I think a lot of people in the Philippines uh, don't play Fortnite because there are other games av available like Valorant, Counter-Strike, etc. But I think Fortnite is really fun. I think it's the most uh, fun game for me to play. And so yeah, I definitely recommend it for everyone. I think if you spend enough time, if you play with the right people, it is the most uh, enjoyable game uh, that you can Thank play. you guys. Those are very interesting tips and tricks that my friends just gave you. I hope you learned something and took something from this video. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This has been your boy Risky. Peace out, yo.